Hi fellow foodies, um, it's Joanne and I'm coming to you live because uh, I'm really proud of something I've done and I wanted to show it off that some of you home cooks might be able to use. Yes, there's no makeup or anything. I'm waiting on my countertop uh, repairman to show up to fix uh, two scenes in my brand new countertops or a year old countertops. So hopefully he won't call right in the middle of this. But I did want to show you um, this as I'm preparing my first pot roast of the fall. I love having pot roast in the fall. So the rub that I make for the pot roast, which you can get the recipe on joannesfoodbites.com. Just uh, search for easy crock pot or easy crock pot roast, I think is what it's under. Um, this is very simple, but... The rub that you put on it takes about six, seven different spices. So I thought this would be a great opportunity to show you how I lay out my spices. So um, I hated going from the pantry to the counter to, it's just so much walking. So let me show you what I have done. I took a, um, this is what craft people would use. It's just a kind of a rolling cart. And I tuck the rolling cart in this spot in my pantry. As you can see, I use our barbecue rubs in these kind of drawers as well. <clears throat> and I have labeled them. So the top drawer has peppers because that's what I use the most. So it's got my black pepper, my ground, what is this, cayenne pepper, I do put my crushed red peppers in there, as well as anything that starts with the letter A or B. So I've got my basil, my allspice, bay leaves. Next is this letter C. I have more spices with C. I couldn't believe it. I've labeled it, and they're all lying in there. D N O T. And what I also put in here is anything that you use to make dressings. Um, Italian dressing, ranch, onion soup. Here's all the chilies, Sloppy Joe's. Of course, that's my husband's. And I put my yeast in this one. Anything that's for Mexican food, those sauce packs. Here I've got pre-made sauces and Asian food type stuff for our stir-fry mixes. And when I really like it, is when I'm making something like this crock pot roast that I'm getting ready to make, I can just wheel this whole thing out and I've got everything readily accessible. And in my kitchen, I put all my measuring devices right here, right next to the pantry. So you can see I've kind of got a staged area where I'm making the rub. So I've got my part here with all my spices and all my measuring devices right here. And I can make the rub in less than three minutes. So, good morning, Nan. Hello, Jennifer. But, um, I just kind of wanted to show that off. I was kind of proud that I got it all labeled. I've got it alphabetized. And this really is such a time saver. So, um, go to Joanne's Food Bites. Go ahead and check out that Easy Crock Pot Roast. I'm telling you, it is well worth it. Um, there's the roast. I've got my pepper, pepper, I don't even know how to say that. There's the peppers that you'll put on top. Believe you me, even though you put these peppers on there, it is not spicy. It will not have any kind of heat. It just provides an extra layer of flavor on the roast. And, um, the liquid to these will seep out and that helps cause, uh, your your sauce or your gravy for it. And of course you'll have to have a stick of butter and your au jus pack. Uh, and um, what's the other thing that we used in that? The beef au jus. Oh, and a ranch seasoning. So, huh, and they're so convenient right here. So we'll use a ranch dip where you can use that bulk stuff that I had bought. But I'll, I'll use those and I'll have to use an au jus. And that's all the ingredients, other than the rub. So, uh, well, thanks, Jennifer. 
Um, the car actually <laughs> was my mother-in-law's. And upon her passing, uh, they divided up all this stuff. And she used it for her scrapbooking organization. So I'm sure she got it at something like Michael's or Joann's or something like that. And I have a bunch of scrapbooking things, but they are not organized by no means. And I needed something to easily put in the pantry. Like I said, that it just slides right in slides right out. I love it. And we use these other type of drawer organizers for um, my husband's rubs. They're a little bit taller so I can get the taller bottles in them. And he has one for sauces. So I just kind of wanted uh, to show that off and um, hope y'all are cooking up a storm. Um, I cannot wait to have this roast tonight. I cannot tell you how good it is. So I think you ought to go and try it. It's so simple. And hope y'all have a great day. Hey, Renee.